Welcome to the presentation of exploring event camera-based odometry for planetary robots, completed in collaboration with the University of Zurich and the Jet Propulsion Lab. Recently, NASA Mars Helicopter Ingenuity completed several successful flights on Mars, paving the way for future planetary exploration using unmanned aerial vehicles. To complete these missions, Visual Inertial Odometry, in short VIO, was a key algorithm since it provided crucial state estimation to the helicopter. Future missions now plan on exploring Martian lava tubes since they could host microbial life and are candidates for the first human base on Mars. However, the low light conditions in these tubes pose significant challenges to existing VIO algorithms. To overcome these challenges, JPL mimics the conditions of these future Mars missions by testing in cave-like environments like the Wells Cave. In this work, we present EKLTVIO, a novel method which targets this scenario using an event camera. EKLTVIO satisfies key constraints posed by the target scenario. On the one hand, helicopter-based flight requires low-weight sensors like cameras, making heavier alternatives like LIDARs infeasible. Additionally, helicopters usually operate near hover conditions or perform fast takeoffs. This means that VIO needs to initialize quickly and robustly and with small baselines. The back end of EKLT VIO is especially suited for this. Similar features are required during sudden disturbances such as oscillations, which may lead to a significant loss of features. If all features are lost, we would require fast recovery capabilities in mid-air. Lava tubes are a low-light environment which cause severe underexposure or motion blur artifacts in standard camera images, motivating the use of an event camera. In lava tubes and elsewhere on Mars, sudden lighting changes may occur, which cause the failure of auto-exposure algorithms. However, since event cameras do not have a shutter, they are immune to these issues. Our proposed method, EKLTVIO, combines the advantages of a state-of-the-art event and frame-based front-end EKLT with a filter-based back-end XVIO, which is optimized for helicopter flight. The front-end takes in synchronous images, which are used to detect features, and events, which it uses to track these features asynchronously. The resulting feature tracks are then fused with IMU measurements in XVIO to compute the camera pose. By combining the advantages of EKLT and XVIO, EKLT VIO is robust in low light and rapidly changing lighting conditions, while being able to handle rapid initialization at takeoff and is highly robust to sudden feature loss during flight anomalies. EKLT VIO derives a significant part of its robustness from adaptively triggering the backend depending on the scene motion. It does this by using a variable rate synchronization step. This step interpolates features to a common timestamp illustrated below with 1D feature tracks. A fixed rate synchronization scheme would inevitably oversample slow motions while undersampling fast motions. By contrast, our adaptive scheme instead samples every n events and thus updates less when little motion is present and more during fast motions, thereby staying efficient and robust in both conditions. In fact, this sampling scheme also impacts our average position error over time. While during slow motion we remain accurate and on par with a fixed rate synchronization step, during fast motions we significantly outperform it. We benchmark EKLT VIO on the well-known event camera dataset on both Sixtoff motion sequences and challenging rotation-only sequences, which closely mimic the near-hover scenarios. There, we compare against state-of-the-art VIO algorithms. Finally, we evaluate our method on new datasets recorded in the JPL Mars Yard and Wells Cave, which we release to the public. We show a 32% improvement over a wide range of state-of-the-art event and frame-based methods. We even outperform Ultimate Slam, which uses a highly accurate optimization-based backend. However, it is highly sensitive to initial bias parameter tuning, which is infeasible on Mars. EKLTVIO, by contrast, does not require IMU bias tuning. EKLTVIO also tracks robustly in purely rotational sequences. Here, other methods either fail to initialize due to small baselines or drift due to motion blurred frames. 
In Mars-like environments, like in the Wells Cave, our algorithm can withstand small baselines and low light conditions, where other algorithms diverge or fail to initialize. Similarly, in HDR conditions, with rapid lighting changes, as in the Mars Yard sequences, our algorithm still successfully tracks while the image-based algorithm diverges. Analyzing the failure modes of other methods, we see that XVIO quickly loses detected features due to its low dynamic range camera, resulting in a flickering visualization. Only at the end does it manage to detect stable features. By contrast, EKLTVIO has more stable features since it makes use of an event camera. In conclusion, we present EKLTVIO, a novel VIO algorithm for Mars helicopter-based exploration of Martian lava tubes. It combines the advantages of a filter-based backend and event and frame-based frontend. While the filter-based backend makes it robust to disturbances and hover-like conditions, the event-based frontend imbues robustness to challenging lighting conditions. We find that our algorithm is 32% more accurate than state-of-the-art event and frame-based VIO algorithms and can robustly handle purely rotational scenarios mimicking hover flight where other methods fail to converge or even initialize. Finally, we release a new Mars-like dataset recorded in the JPL Mars Yard and Wells Cave where we show robust performance. For paper, dataset and open source code, visit our project page.